Good morning friends. On Friday, the Dow Jones Industrial Average closed flat and as of now, Gift Nifty is trading up by 100 points. So we can expect a gap up opening in the Nifty today. Coming to the stocks in news, the first stock is Reliance. Reliance Industries has said the board of directors of Reliance Retail approved a reduction of the equity share capital to the extent held by shareholders other than its promoter and the holding company Reliance Retail Ventures. Upon reduction, the shares held by such shareholders will stand cancelled. A consideration of Rs. 1362 a share determined on the basis of valuation obtained from two reputed independent registered valuers will be paid towards the capital reduction, it said. So, because of this, the EPS of Reliance Industries will increase and we can expect an up move in the stock of Reliance. The next stock is Zydus Life Sciences. The US FDA has closed the pre-approval inspection with nil observations for Zydus Group's manufacturing facility in Ahmedabad. The FDA inspected the facility from July 2 to 7. So we can expect an up move in the stock of Zydus Life. The third stock is Vedanta. The Natural Resources and Technology Conglomerate has added semiconductors and display glass manufacturing ventures to its diversified portfolio. It has got the board's nod for acquiring 100% in Vedanta Foxconn semiconductors and Vedanta displays via share transfer at face value. VFSPL and VDL are wholly owned subsidiaries of Twin Star Technologies, which is a wholly owned subsidiary of Volcan Investments, the holding company of Vedanta. So we can expect an up in the stock of Vedanta as well. The last stock is Arabindo Pharma. Subsidiary Cura Tech Biologics has entered into an exclusive license agreement with Biofactura Incorporation USA to commercialize BFI 751, a proposed biosimilar to Stellara. Uh, this Stellara is a recombinant monoclonate antibody used for treating Crohn's disease, ulcerative colitis, plaque prosaris, and prosaritic arthritis. So we can expect an up move in the stock of Arabindo Pharma as well. Thank you.